Beth, will you do me the honor and marry me? No! Yes! This is a disaster! Where are you going? I'm going to go check up on Cinnamon. Why? Let her dad take care of it. She's faking it anyways. We're going to be rich. Tootsie, she's family now. Try to understand. Mary? Oh. Oh. What was that? You ran someone over, Mary? What if we put this body in there and dress it up to be you? You have life insurance? Are you sure we'll be able to get away with this? With the performance that I'm going to put on, no one will doubt that you're dead. I can't believe we got 2.4 million dollars. They faked Gladys' death to get insurance money. That is where the money came from. <gasps> I think my water just broke. The baby's coming. I'm gonna be a dad. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, babe. You got this. Just keep breathing. Oh, baby, daddy. If you don't shut up, I swear to God, I'm gonna rip your head off. Don't use a labor as an excuse for getting out of committing insurance fraud. Yeah, I know. I already called the cops and they're on their way. Mm, really? Because where are they? It's been like 30 minutes. This is not how I wanted to bring my precious baby into the world. Calm down, babe. I'm here for you. Oh, I'm only here because of you, you dimwit. I feel like a doctor should be here. But where is the doctor? That baby doesn't want to come out, huh? <laughs> can you give me some more paid cures? Actually, can I get in on that action too? I cannot give you any more, young girl. It is not safe. And you are almost fully dilated. What does that mean? Are you kidding me? Don't be like that. This is the miracle of birth. And look, all your friends are here with you. Oh. We are not friends. <laughs> we are just making sure she doesn't escape. Escape? You kids are playing tag. Oh, never grow up. I love it. Okay, I have a copy of your ultrasound. Let's take a look. You are having a healthy baby boy. Yeah, boys wanted to have a son. I could teach him to play football. <laughs> No. Good. Okay, I'll teach her football. I have to take this or I will lose my job. I will be back. You know, Mary, I've been thinking. I've actually been doing a lot of that lately since I'm about to be a father. I want to be in this kid's life and I want to be in yours too. So... Let's do it your way. Let's get married, Mary. <laughs> John, this is what I always wanted. Now my parents won't think I'm a baseless sinner. So what do you say? Yes, 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 a thousand times yes. Awesome. <laughs> oh my God, this was so unexpected. I love a happy ending. I just wish it was me. Wow, Chad, you really did something here. It looks expensive. Uh, I can't believe I'm engaged. Yo, I'm so happy. At least she will get married before she goes to jail. Uh, hi, I'm looking for Mary. There you are. Hmm. Are you, like, her cousin or something? Actually, I'm the father of the kid she's having. Nice to meet you, though. I'm Gerald. What? Father? I managed to get early leave. I wanted to surprise you, but you surprised me. Yo, G.I. Joe, you got the wrong Mary. Don't touch my fiance.
Yep, perfect. I'm gonna look amazing. You're gonna look so gorgeous, Cinnamon. Not like that was ever in jeopardy. What is taking the doctor so long? I've been waiting forever. Darling, it's only been 10 minutes. They probably couldn't find a plastic surgeon that was talented enough to fix you up. Can't blame them though. It's a good thing we're not biologically related. I would hate to inherit those genes. Tootsie, be nice. No, Beth, it's okay. I'm actually more concerned for you. Me? Yes, it can't be easy knowing that you gave birth to a literal donkey. <laughs> High five. Don't worry, Mr. Sumit, everything will be okay. Please cover your mouth when you cough. Uncle G, Tootsie, you didn't tell me Rhea's father works here. Hello, Sunny. What is taking so long? Okay, hello. Cinnamon, everything okay? Everything is not okay, doctor. I've been waiting forever, and if that isn't bad enough, I have to share this room with that loser who thinks deodorant is a myth. Loser, deodorant's real. I found out last year. Ah, I do use deodorant. All the doctors and operating rooms are occupied right now because of the incident by the ocean. Whatever, where is my plastic surgeon, Dr. Costello? Maybe I need to remind him how much daddy has done for this hospital. Oh, you didn't get the email. He is on emergency leave. Some malpractice thing. A butt lift gone wrong. What? I wanted one of those. I'm the donkey. You're the one who wants to get a new ass. I have to admit, I'm surprised you're a plastic surgeon. No boob. I mean Beth, I am not a plastic surgeon. I am an optometrist, pedometrist, cardiologist, and ear doctor. And they're also making me deliver a baby. This hospital and its cuts. Do you really think I'm gonna let him operate on me? Absolutely not. I guess I have to take my business to South Korea where they know what they're doing. Oh, South Korea, how beautiful. Ooh, maybe I'll go with your father on our honeymoon. I love hospital food. It's such a delicacy. Ooh, I know how this would be even better. A Twinkie. Doctor, maybe when you're done with my stepsister, you can help her disgusting best friend. Let him operate on me first, and then if it's successful, he'll do it on you. No, Rhubarb, that's too much of a risk for me. Mm, yeah, because we have two different body types. Yeah, that's it. I get my shoulders from my father. You're dismissed. You don't want procedure? Okay, not my problem. I'm very busy. I have to deliver a baby. Goodbye. Oh, Mr. Smith, I'm not seeing him. Someone else will change your diapers. I didn't know you could deliver a baby. Is that like on Postmates or Uber Eats or something? Mm, delicious. You should be looking for tickets to South Korea. And see if Blackpink is doing a concert as well. Might as well make the most of it. In the meantime, why don't you come with Tootsie and I to the bridal shop? We're finalizing our outfits for the wedding. It's actually right around the corner. Mom. You can't come. You obviously have a lot of work to do. You can't be the ugliest at prom. I need these surgeries for prom, Beth, which is literally next week. It's because she has big boobs. There's not a lot of circulation that goes to her brain. Oh, I see. Um, you sure you can't spare a few hours? No, prom is literally the most important day of my life. It only comes around once in a lifetime. Who knows how many times you're gonna get married? I know you're angry, but nothing calms you down more than shopping. So come join us. Fine, I'll come. Lovely, let's go, daughters. Where is my white coat? I don't have time for this, I have patience to treat. It's right here. Doctor, doctor, I think I'm sick. Love sick for you. Sir, sir, are you okay? Sir, sir, are you okay? Please help. Oh my God, still you are in liver. I can see the head! Come on! You can do this, Mary! There's a literal head coming out of you. 
How are you managing? <laughs> Looks like an alien. Congratulations. <laughs> I will hold it. I'm gonna name her after my late cousin, Gladys. Good. Now that your baby is out, eh? tell us where Gladys is. Hm. Okay, I'll tell you. She's. Don't even try faking it. I know what you're doing. So if you don't come clean right now about oh Gladys, the cops will be here hand. and yes. oh, Hold it by the head! Oh. 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 This is a heavy baby boy. This is perfect. One kid for each of you. This, this is such a wonderful surprise. Actually, as beautiful as it was to see the miracle of birth, I don't think I'm the father. Congrats on the twins, man. Just, just grab the ring back and I'll just head out. Don't worry, Gerald. We're gonna be so happy together. We don't need him. He's dumb anyways. Funny you should say that because I've actually concluded that I'm not the father. Sorry to intrude on this crucial family moment, but I'm gonna head out now. Deuces. You two are a bunch of useless assholes! Mary? Who are you? I'm the lucky son of a guy who managed to get this angel pregnant. What? Mary, what is going on? Is that my kid? I, I guess this one too, but I already bonded with her. Twins? Yes, twins. You don't mind, do you? What's the matter? Here, hold this! I think she is stressed. I don't know why, the worst is over. Track between my legs, you idiot! My diagnosis is that her hot girl summer is finally catching up to her and her criminal ways. I'd be screaming my head off too if I was her. Criminal ways? I don't think so. I believe there are too many people in this room. You guys, you need to leave. There's no freaking way! There is no way. Really? Where'd you get your medical degree in the basement? Oh! Stay positive. Huh. Maybe it's not a baby in there. <laughs> Another healthy baby boy. Congratulations. Uh, uh, uh. At least now there's one for each of us. <laughs> hey, take this. <laughs> this is a very crazy shift. I will send you home with some pamphlets. Huh? How to know? How to Huh? How is that even possible? Oh, you guys are going to have bum fat. <laughs> the sweet release! I'm like a machine! This is already a skin! What if it never stops? Oh, Doc! I have another surprise for you! There's no way. There's no way. Check under the Christmas tree. A healthy baby girl. Girl, your womb is like a garage. How many babies are in there? Hello? Hello? I think it is over. How many are there? Six. Six kids. I gave birth to six kids. Thank you, God. 
Thank you for giving me six healthy babies. Oh, I'm gonna take care of six kids. That is not my problem. With all the insurance money she stole, she thinks we forgot. The police are in the building, I'm sure of it. Oh, Mama is going to jail. At least she knows who her roommates will be. My babies, they're so beautiful. I kind of feel bad though. Just push it out of your mind. I have to go. Duty calls. No, dear. It seems to be emphasizing all the wrong things. No offense, Mom, but those things emphasize themselves. But I want to come off as a loving wife, not a trophy wife. Relax, Mom. You look amazing. Give me a twirl. You, dear. You look amazing. I know I said I wanted to go more punk for the wedding, but I changed my mind. I want to wear white. Only the bride can wear white. Whoever made that stupid rule up clearly hasn't seen me in white. Or maybe they did and they got jealous. You will look so fantastic at the wedding. I'm afraid all eyes will be on you and not on me. And I'm the one who's supposed to get married. Your new mom looks amazing. I don't need a new mom. I have a mom. You mean the mom that you haven't talked to or seen in years? Doesn't sound like a mom to me. Well, neither is Pat. I don't know. She's nice and sweet to you. And she always gives me long hugs whenever I ask. Her hugs are so big and soft. She's just a gold digger, Rhubarb. And she just pretends to care about me. If she's pretending, she's a pretty good pretender to me. Cinnamon, dear, come here. I want your opinion. Cinnamon, darling, come here. I want your opinion. She's so demanding. That's not what she sounds like. It's more like this. Cinnamon, darling, come here. I want your opinion. Like that. Don't ever do that again. Coming back. Let's go. So, what do you think, Doc? I think it's time for me to go home and sleep. There is no way this is real. Hey, you're not allowed in here. <gasps> Officers, uh, just who I was looking for. What are you doing here? Huh? Officer, I have to, I need to talk to you. Please come with me. Hey, get out of here. There's a criminal in that room and I need your help. Please, Fine, get out. Thank you, this way. It is urgent. Officer, she is the one I was talking about. Her cousin died. Sorry for your loss, miss. Officer, you're not understanding. Her cousin didn't actually die. Is she here in spirit? Is the cousin in the room with us right now? He's a little woozy, officer. He saw some things I guess he wasn't ready for. Officer, she has all the insurance money. She faked her cousin's death and now she's trying to get away with it. So she faked her cousin's death and made off with the insurance money? Hey! Nah, that doesn't look like a criminal to me. I've been in this business for 30 years. I know a criminal when I see one. No, but- I'm willing to answer any questions you have, officer. After I breastfeed my six children, of course. Might take a while. And even if she was raising all those kids, that's more of a punishment than any court can throw at her. Is it really that bad? No, it's worse. <gasps> Who are you guys? The fathers? Oopsies, it was a great summer officer. Thank God only three showed up. Good luck, soon inflation is gonna make diapers the price of gold. Really? Uh, gold? I could barely afford my prom ticket. I, uh, I think I left something in my car. I'll be right back, Mary. Okay, hurry back, sweetheart. Yeah, I think I'm getting a call from base camp. Duty calls. See ya, Mary. Okay, don't forget to rate me. I, um, 
Mary, I... Oh, Chad, we're gonna be so happy together. I'm gonna need another one. <laughs> Men, can't live with them, can't live without them. <laughs> no, you could totally live without them. Excuse me, officer, but me and my babies have to use the restroom. Again, it might take a while. Oh, of course, my work here is done. Excuse me? What did you just say to me? She said you should stay away from the bride because of your red hair dye. I know what she said. I'm just surprised she has the nerve to since my father's paying for everything. Girls, 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 please stop arguing. If your father sees you like this, it will break his heart. And you being with him only for his money, wouldn't that break his heart too? Hey, my mom is not a gold digger. Don't think I can't see through your act. Let's get out of here, Rhubarb. Miss Titty's mom, can I have a big hug, please? I said let's go. This is horrible. I wanted her to be here with me. Ew, why? Because when I pictured getting married, I wanted my daughter there with me. And she's my daughter as well. <sighs> Let's go, cousin! Why do you have so many babies with you? I had six! How is that even possible? And the cop never found out that we stole the insurance money. Now, put the car and drive, and drive. Mommy loves you. Try not to fly out of the basket. Last year was hot girl summer. This year is rich girl summer. Drive. I'm in just to see. What did we see? I know, that was a lot of drama, even for me. Six. I mean, it makes sense. She was pregnant for like 13 months. I still wonder where Gladys is. Who cares? I'm over it. Whatever little insurance money she made won't last her past a week. Do you know how expensive diapers are? I don't know. You think I wear diapers? No. You look more like a candy thong kind of guy. Stop it, please. We both need some sleep. Together? Sure. My mommy would never allow sleepover. You would be such a good dad. Daddy. I need to go home. What am I supposed to do? I have no plans today. Mom, can you come help me zip up my dress, please? Oh, I don't know. I tried to get her to stay here. This is such an important moment for me and I wanted to share it with her. I don't know Mom. what else to do. Oh, one second, sweetie. I'm just on the phone. Mom, can you hear me? Oh, darling, I don't know. Maybe give Cinnamon a call and see why she's upset. Uh, uh, why do they make these zippers so hard to put up? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no. Uh, Eres perfecta mujer. De la cabeza a los pies. Tú pasas de mi nivel. Tú tienes... Thank you. Hi, I'm Tootsie. I know who you are. Huh? I'm Katarina. Shopping for a wedding? Huh? So am I. Can someone please bring me the most expensive and exclusive dress here? And a glass of champagne would be nice too. Mom, look, come! I made a friend! I'm coming, Tootsie Darling. Hello, Elizabeth. How is my dearest husband and my daughter, Cinnamon? Katarina Rodriguez. No freaking way. What are you doing here? It looks like my invitation got lost in the mail. Hmm? I didn't know you could just order a baby. Is that like Uber Eats or Postmates or something? Eats? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm weird. Strawberry, I'm scared. What if it never stops? 
not my problem. I won't be leaving here. I'm tight as a whistle. <laughs> what? This is a very crazy shift. I will send you home with some pamphlets. I'm so be.